Not only are we hearing that Black Widow is going to get a pretty big delay coming up any moment now, more and more things are pointing towards an entire phase delay by upwards of a year. So let's talk about the inevitable disappointment unless Black Widow drops on video on demand. So just recently, Variety updated their sort of um, outlook on Hollywood, if you will. And one of the big things that you have to talk about is the recent releases, specifically one of the highly most anticipated releases of the last couple of years, Wonder Woman 1984, and its disappointing and dismal box office take, and what this means for the future. And they went straight into talking about all the different franchises, WB's output, their strategy with HBO Max, and of course, Marvel Studios' Disney counter to this, and their biggest film that's coming out being Black Widow. Well, they're anticipating that Black Widow is going to see another delay. This time, it could be even more significant than we've previously heard. Now, as of right now, it's scheduled for May 7th, and the belief is that they might delay it up into July, meaning that Shang-Chi's July release would get bumped back into November, Eternals November release would get bumped into March or April of next year, and everything would cascade one after another. Spider-Man and Sony releases, probably, well, probably not on the release slate, let's be real. Now, some other people are saying that this might not actually be everything that happens, because, uh, let's be real, um, just the way it's looking right now, the way we're looking at it, we're not going back to theaters in July the way it was. That's just not going to happen. United States alone that's not going to happen we're probably a year away from that and even then people are still going to be hesitant so what exactly is going to happen they're saying you could see a pretty substantial delay like black widow bumping into november then you're looking at Eternals from this November to the November after in 2022. So you're looking at delays for some of these movies at possibly upwards of two years from their original release date, just sort of sitting and banking on them, while also other projects that are currently shooting will also be wrapped up and fully complete for them to sit on. Now, how exactly they handle this is really going to be, I guess, up to Disney because the next investor's call is in, well, it's in a little bit, so we got a little bit to go but um the belief is that they're just gonna sort of um go and admit defeat against this because there's no way to defeat it yet and say hey we're gonna do day and date digital we'll put it out in theaters whatever the hell happens happens but of course you know um i guess we just have to wait and see what disney does but again, um, expect a pretty significant delay because Variety's reporting it and other people are chiming in saying, yeah, it's coming. So um, look forward to seeing Black Widow at the end of the year or next spring.